सो हाई डियर कैंसर अ वेरी वेरी गुड इवनिंग टू यू गाइज दिस इज अंजलि टैरो एंड दिस इज अ जर्नल रीडिंग फॉर ऑल द कैंसर सन मून मीनस राइजिंग जस्ट गिव मी अ सेकेंड टू चेक इट क्विकली आर वी डूइंग द राइट साइन या so uh, it's a general love reading for all of you from 13 till the 19th of november keep in mind it's general it might or might not resonate with you at the first place the rules can be reversed also and it's a uh, valid for every 12 signs that you're dealing with along with your own sign so let's start your person or your partner's current feelings for you right now at this present moment like uh, uh, let's see cancer we have the 10 of pentacles okay this is someone who feels like a family kind of dynamic with you or they feel like having this kind of dynamic with you in the coming future they see you in their future they visualize you in their future for some reason they are like okay even if you guys are not together i think this person is feeling like a family kind of vibe from you let's clarify the 10 of pentacles like a marriage material kind of thing we have the lovers the seven of pentacles and the ace of swords okay wow <laughs> they are waiting on you for something here this person is highly attracted to you uh, like physically as well and mentally and emotionally as well they are waiting for some kind of clarity they are waiting for some kind of answers this person is definitely like uh, seeing you as a marriage material kind of a thing they feel like you are you are somebody with whom they can spend the rest of their life with you are kind of a person who can handle them who can handle a uh, uh, like a relationship well so all they want a, is like all they feel right now is to get the clarity from your side so that they can pick up uh, the situation from where it was like uh, left and then they can move forward in the situation between you and them just give me a second honey yeah so this is what this person is feeling now let's see what do you feel about this particular person or situation from your side cancer what are your feelings the chariot you uh, you on the other hand is in this energy of okay let me move on let me be successful and victorious my in my own life let me have something good or someone good like uh, something better or someone better okay you might not be participating in this connection the way this energy is connected with you let's clarify the chariot we have the judgment the seven of wands and the nine of cups okay you feel like uh, being happy on your own cancer right now you are not ready to give any kind of second chances to anybody who broke your heart or heart or who used you in some way shape or form you feel like uh, like uh, keeping your energies protected from those who feels like using you in some way shape or form and uh, not letting you be happy it's like you just feel like moving on to something better or someone better better and be happy in your own life individually for some of you you might be choosing to remain single and uh, happy in your life with or without anybody okay this is the right uh, thing right now that you are doing and you feel like working on your own personal growth and expansion working on your own personal uh, satisfaction or own personal goals let's see what this person wants from you what are their intentions for the situation between you and them cancer let's see queen of wands this person wants to manifest a connection between you and them this person definitely wants to manifest a beautiful passionate kind of start in the uh, in this situation and they want to manifest a good relationship between you and them okay let's clarify the queen of wands okay just give me a second we have the six of cups the magician and the 10 of pentacles this is someone who is missing like uh, missing you like crazy they want to manifest a beautiful relationship a solid committed kind of relationship and or a marriage and a long term kind of partnership between you and them this is what this person wants okay 
they want to marry you i can't simplify this more than this they want to marry you they want to see you in their future they see you as a marriage material kind of thing who can handle connections and relationships beautifully i think uh, you gave them the reason to make them feel like this you gave them something like uh, either you didn't gave up on them uh, and you provided them the safety and security of a beautiful emotional connection or you did something for them in the recent past that this person is convinced that you are a marriage material kind of a person you are not uh, just for fun or uh, flirting around kind of a personality i don't know what you did now the roles can be reversed also please keep that in mind this is somebody who definitely wants to find a peaceful solution to the problem that you guys are facing in this situation at this present moment let's see what do you want from this particular person or situation from your side cancer what are your intentions for the situation fool card see you just want to break free from this kind of a dynamic you are like you gave them chances over chances you gave them everything that you had you gave them emotional security you go you gave them the uh, trust you gave them the, your loyalty and now you just want to break free from the situation you are like i have done my best i did my best i gave my best now i cannot handle this nonsense let's clarify the fool card we have the higher of wands the queen of pentacles and the six of wands okay so so you are in this energy of if you are going to get higher level of commitment from someone if you are going to feel like yes this is the person that i can go ahead with even if we are not going to get married we are going to have a very beautiful connection with each other and you just want to uh, like uh, focus on that kind of energy if you are getting that kind of dynamic from this person you are ready to go ahead if not you are ready to go solo but you have a perfect vision in your mind of how a perfect relationship or how a perfect connection should be uh, how uh, you know how it should be how they should behave how they should uh, connect with you on that level higher level of commitment level and you want a very beautiful successful victorious kind of energies for yourself you want to be successful in your life whatever you are trying to do right now you just want to be successful in that professionally i am talking about and if you are getting somebody who is on the same page as you are regarding relationships you are ready to go ahead with them else you are ready to go solo and focus on your individual go goals and success and victory wow see so you are ready to walk away from something or someone that's not serving you or your purpose anymore and you are like ready to let it go let's see what's coming towards you in love till the 19th of november cancer four of swords massive healing a break you will be on the healing mode and at the same time you will be taking some kind of break from something or someone i don't know if it's a permanent break or it's just a break <laughs> let's clarify the four of swords here we have the queen of wands the five of wands and the 10 of wands i do see you dropping a situation dropping something or someone because it's too much drama to handle too much drama too much of chaos and too much of fights and issues and ifs and buts and this and that you are going to choose yourself or eventually you are going to be in this energy of okay let me handle my own personality let me handle my own things let me handle my own life this situation is quite heavy and burdensome so let me drop it you will be dropping a particular person or situation and you will be on your own at least for this week and you will be having this massive healing kind of energy going on with inside of you because you are coming out of a very stressful phase i think it's related to family issues also either from your side or from the person that you are attached to and that is why the energies are more heavy to deal with but i do see you dropping that finally and coming to yourself and uh, coming in your power and taking a charge of your life 
and having massive healing kind of thing hmm and i do see your heart chakra being completely closed off for relation love and relationship kind of dynamic or you are going to be so hurt from inside for whatever reason i do see that this is not only about love and relationship kind of dynamic it's about family kind of issues also you are going to be quite hurt and you will not be able to see what what you should do in this situation so you will be just taking a break from everything and everyone dropping everything and everyone and just uh, being with yourself for the, for the time being Let's see the guidance for you guys in the situation. Cancer. Yeah, sorry about the vendors, street vendors. Mm -hmm. They are also doing their job like me, right? So the gu guidance here is the uh, five of cups, the sun and the knight of cups. Mm -hmm. See, a cancer, it might sound filmy to you guys. Lots of of lots of my healing clients and lots of my coach, uh, coaching clients also say this sounds very filmy, but this is the only thing that can bring you the happiness that you want. Start giving gifts to yourself. Start loving yourself. Start taking care of yourself. Stop stop living in this illusion that somebody else is responsible for your happiness. You are responsible for your happiness. You might not be responsible for your sadness or bad times. But you are responsible for your happiness. Keep that in mind and never forget that. Nobody else, no one on earth, not even your parents, not your siblings, no, not your spouse, nobody else on earth is responsible for your happiness. You Happiness is a choice and state of mind. You yourself is uh, like uh, uh, responsible completely for that. And uh, you have to start giving that kind of love, that kind of affection, that kind of uh, energy to yourself and stay happy. If you want to come out of this victim mode, you have to start loving yourself. You have to start taking care of yourself like crazy. And you have to be in this energy of knowing the truth and accepting the truth, truth that no one else on earth is responsible for your happiness. Period. So thank you so much for tuning in Cancer. I'll see you soon in the next video. Bye-bye. Take care. God bless you. Namaste.